Uh, my name is John Yee. I'm the head of thoracic surgery at uh, Vancouver General Hospital and at UBC. I'm the director of the BC Lung Transplant Program. So, uh, in 2002, only one double lung transplant was done. And uh, this year, we've done uh, 51 double lung transplants and one single lung transplant. So a total of 52 patients. Dramatic increase. I think there are multiple factors for that. Number one is that there's uh, more availability of organs due to the work of BC Transplant. Um, there are more patients that are finding themselves with uh, end-stage lung failure. Uh, I think what's contributed to the uh, success of the program is that uh, we've trained um, a multidisciplinary uh, team here at the hospital, which includes surgeons, anesthesiologists, critical care, and nursing staff, so we can get uh, excellent results. Our long-term survival results exceed the national average. I think um, the community sees that patients who are critically ill uh, have had their lives saved, they've returned to normal lives, and the, the patients are really our best ambassadors for the program as they go back to their families. There's more awareness that lung transplantation is a viable option, and of course, the, the more um, patients that we take care of, the better our teams become. I'm very proud of the people that we have here. Um, we've built a very strong crew of young, highly qualified, and now highly experienced uh, um, people who are ready for the future. So uh, we're predicting that uh, the next few years we'll see uh, further growth. Uh, the demand for lung transplantation it remains very high. We currently still don't have enough organs to service all the patients who are coming for lung transplantation. And uh, I think BC Transplant has helped tremendously over the years. Uh, I think one of the big reasons why we've had a record year this year is through the efforts of BC Transplant to educate the public as to um, uh, the possibility of organ donation.